Hello everyone. I've had a lot of people ask me how I sterilize and clean my hummingbird feeders. This is a gallon of hot water. I put in a quarter cup of white distilled vinegar. You're gonna put your parts in. Let them soak. I've got this scrub brush, heavy scrub brush. I've got a little brush for the ports. You can use a mascara brush, a clean mascara brush. They sell little packs of them on Amazon and uh, for what at Walmart. Now use a bottle brush for the top part. Let's take the bottle brush, scrub your top real good, outside. Like I said, this one's already clean. I'm gonna show you this anyways. Take your uh, port part. Scrub all these little holes thoroughly. This is where the hummingbirds will stick their bills in and sometimes they'll have dirt, all kinds of debris on them. And that's what causes the problems with mold and stuff like that. But if you clean your feeders regularly, you know, I have never had mold on any of my feeders. But I clean my feeders every other day. I don't sterilize them every day, every other day, but I clean them in hot water, scrub them real good. Do all the same thing I'm doing here, and you'll never have a problem. I got that done. Take your scrub brush, scrub all these little parts here. This scrub brush actually fits into these little grooves right here. Scrub real good. You know, this feeder's already clean. Main thing is just elbow grease, scrub, scrub, scrub. This brush also fits into these, but I go ahead and use both brushes. That way you don't have to take no chances. Clean it off thoroughly. Like I said, I'm, this is already clean. I'm just gonna show you my procedures here. All right, when you're done that with that, run you some hot water. I'm going to let this out. Rinse all your parts thoroughly. Make sure you get all the vinegar residue off. And in there, outside. Get it all clean. Then you'll want to towel dry everything. That way you make sure you get all the vinegar residue off. On a normal cleaning, I just use hot water, scrub brush, and do the same thing I'm doing here. Hummingbirds be coming back pretty soon. I've not put one out yet. I probably do it at the first of the month, maybe March 10th. I've actually had some people tell me in Florida they've seen hummingbirds, so which is I think it's a little early, but you never know. I like it much better when they get a video or a picture. Everything dried real good. Make sure it's, you know, you want to make sure all the vinegar is gone. And there you have it. A clean, sterilized hummingbird feeder ready to go. If y'all would, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate y'all and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.